फॉर्मूला ऑफ मोलैरिटी इज नंबर ऑफ मोल्स नंबर ऑफ मोल्स ऑफ विच ऑफ सॉल्यूट इफ वी मेक अ सॉल्यूशन द सब्सटेंस व्हिच इज इन लेस क्वांटिटी इज नोन एज सॉल्यूट डिवाइड बाय वॉल्यूम of solution in liter so volume should be in liter so here present in 1 liter solution means volume should be in liter ok now take an example let uh, we have a container uh, let uh, this is the container and uh, or we can say a glass or water or something else and the volume of this glass or container is 1 liter 1 liter and its molarity is 0.3 m so we know that what is volume so what does this 0.3 m molarity representing it is representing that in this solution there are 0.3 moles of solute are present. Now take another example. <clears throat> In this example, I will demonstrate how we can calculate molarity. <clears throat> Let's take a, a glass of water. And as you know that uh, the volume of glass of water is approximately 250 ml. So I am taking same. Volume is 250 ml. And mixing uh, a solute uh, we can mix uh, sodium chloride or sodium hydroxide calcium carbonate anything so I'm taking here sodium hydroxide because it will easy to calculate uh, like we are mixing 20 gram of sodium hydroxide and AOH <clears throat> and uh, making a solution so this is our final solution as NaOH is in solid state, so there will no change in volume, approximately no change in volume. <clears throat> so here volume was 250 ml and still volume will 250 ml and this is water and now it contains some molecules of NaOH and the mass of NaOH is 20 gram. <clears throat> and I try to calculate the molarity of this solution. To calculate molarity, we need to find number of moles of solute. So what is solute? Here, sodium hydroxide is in less quantity, so it will solute. So find the number of moles of NaOH. Number of moles of solute, which is NaOH, is given mass divided by molecular or formula mass we can use molecular mass we can use formula mass that means mass uh, molecular uh, formula mass of any OH. ah what is the formula mass given mass is we know that uh, given mass is 20 gram so i can plug here 20 gram but uh, we need to calculate formula mass so let's solve it here uh, formula mass of NaOH or we can say molecular mass of NaOH NaOH here you can see there is only one atom of sodium and only one atom of oxygen and also one atom of hydrogen the Atomic mass of sodium is 23 gram. Atomic mass of oxygen is 16 gram. And for hydrogen it is 1. After calculating it we will get 40 gram per mole. Because molecular mass or formula mass is representing gram per mole. Now, we have formula or molecular mass. So I can plug here 40 gram per mole. Gram will cancel out, 0 will cancel out, 2 is divided by 4, we will get 0 
mole will move to numerator and we will get 0.5 mole. Yeah. So we have calculated number of moles of solute in this solution. Now we need to find volume of solution in liter. So what is volume? It is 250 ml but we need to convert it into liter. So 250 ml is equal to 250 ml into now convert it into liter and we know that 1 liter has 1000 ml ml has cancel out 0 also has cancel out 25 is divided by 100 and we will get 0 0.25 0 0.25 liter so this is the volume of solution in liter now we can plug both the values uh, volume value of number of moles of solute which is 0 0.5 mole and volume of solution in liter so plug in this equation what is the number of moles of solute we have calculated it is 0 0.5 what is the volume it is 0 0.25 extend the 0 to cancel out 25 to 50 after uh, neglecting the decimal points and we will get 0 mole per liter or we can write 2m this is the answer this is the molarity of this solution so in this problem you have learned what is the definition of molarity what is the formula of molarity what is molarity and how can we calculate molarity